Let's see. It's on. All right. Shalom, right, Israel. Back with another GMS on the go with the Raleigh, North Carolina camp. Before we go any further, we want to give all honor, glory, and praises to the Heavenly Father, His only begotten Son. Y'all by Shimmy, I was shy. Next up, double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone. I'm teaching that this 100% truth of the Bible. That's right. And a double shalom to all the sincere outcomes throughout the four corners of the earth, pushing this truth and righteousness and sincerity to the best of your ability. And we're going to get into a quick lesson real quick. Um, verse scripture, what you got, Jeremiah? 3 and 15. Kind. Okay. Okay, this is the book of Jeremiah, chapter 3, verse 15. And I will give you pastors according to my heart, mm -hmm. which shall feed you with knowledge and understanding. Right, so the most I say he's going to give you so-called blacks, Latino, and the Americans pastors according to his heart. And heart goes back to the Hebrew word alive, which means your mind. So you, you so-called blacks, Latino, and the Americans are going to get pastors according to the most high's mind. And those pastors he's going to give you are going to be men who's going to give you the 100% truth of the Bible. And you know, and those men that he's going to give you, those men that he set up, which are the real men of Great Millstone, start with the apostles of the elders of Great Millstone to the men on down. Mm -hmm. Those are the pastors that he's going to give you according to his mind. Because we're the, we're, we're, we're the ones breaking down the truth according to the Bible. We're, we're, we're telling you that, you know, the laws wasn't done away with. We're telling you that Israel is the only one who can be saved. We're, we're telling you that um, all these nations are going to save you. So we're, we're giving you the truth according to the Bible. We're not sugarcoating anything. We're giving you the good and the bad, you know, the ugly and mm -hmm. the good. So... Most times gonna give you so called blacks, Latino, and Americans pastors according to his mind, and they're gonna feed you with knowledge. They're gonna feed you with the knowledge, of wisdom, understanding, the truth of this Bible. Come on, Yahweh Shemai Shai said that men, said that men, you know, like the brother, sorry, apostles, elders, the teachers, they that Babylon the Great is America, mm -hmm. that's not the Vatican, and you know, and that, you know, basically that's that's why I want to chime in that Babylon the Great is you know, America, and reincarnation is in the scriptures. God. There you go. That's what I want to say. Con. In the in the in the earth is round. Con. Yeah, that's yeah. Con. All right. And did you want verse sixteen or you want to go to Jeremiah three um, twenty three? Go to Jeremiah twenty three. All right. This book of Jeremiah, chapter twenty three. Slocky brothers. Hold on. Oh wait. Matter of fact, go to Isaiah eight and twenty. Okay, con slocky. This is the book of Isaiah. The book of Isaiah, chapter 8, verse 20. And it reads, To the law and to the testimony, if they speak not according to this word, it is because there is no light in them. All right. Because before we just got this scripture, the last scripture just said, The most I was going to give you so-called blacks, Latino, and Americans, pastors according to his mind, they're going to feed you with knowledge. So they're going to feed you the truth. But this scripture here, Isaiah 8 and 20, said, If they speak not according to this word right here, is because there's no light in them. So you got a lot of pastors out here, you know, and, and a lot of false Israelites who are here. It's not pre um, it's not speaking according to this word, you know. They're, they're they're telling you, like I said earlier, that laws are done away with. That you can eat shrimp, pork, crab, lobster. That you can um sleep with the next man's wife, vice versa. That you can celebrate all these um pagan holidays such as Christmas, Thanksgiving, Easter, Fourth of July, your birthday. Telling you that, that you can um. Worship um, all these false gods, who are not gods, such as Cesar Borgia, Allah, Santa Maria, Buddha. So these false, these false pastors, they're not speaking according to this word, you know. Because if they were speaking according to this word, they would be following everything this word says. But they're not. They're going off. So, not, so there's no light in these pastors, these lying pastors. Yep, like the Crafo Dollars, kind. the Eddie Long Thong, Louis Farrakhan, whatever, however you say his name. The Joel Osteen. Yep. Oh, he was Kurt Frankenstein. Come on, your local pastors and your um and your um you know right up the street from you too. Mm-hmm. Cause they TD all snakes. they all teaching the same thing. I'm gonna get that Jeremiah. This is um the book of Jeremiah, chapter twenty three, verse one. Mm -hmm. Woe be unto the pastors. Mm -hmm. That destroy and shatter the sheep of right. my pastor. Right. The scripture said, Woe. Woe means death and destruction. Death and destruction unto these pastors, like we said. T D on T D Jakes, on um, Joe Osteen, Curfillo Dollar, death and destruction to all y'all and to these false leaders of the Israel like the group. Death and destruction to y'all. Because mm -hmm. y'all destroy and scatter the sheep. 
you know, of the Most High's pasture. And that word pasture is, basically means flock. Y'all destroyed the Most High's sheep, you know. Um, how did y'all destroy the sheep? By telling them that um, the laws were done away with. Tell them that, um, um, what is it? Um, so like it. That God loves everybody. Yeah, kind of. God loves everybody. So mm -hmm. you, you destroyed the nation of Israel by um, telling them all those lies. And you scattered them by telling them that, um, and so I can go and um, y'all destroyed them by um, teaching the false doctrines. And mm -hmm. you destroyed them by telling them that um, Allah was the way, Buddha was the way, mm -hmm. Santa Maria was the way. So you got us going, you got our um, our people out here worshiping these false gods who are no gods. And can that's I, how you just scattered them. Can I, and I correction earlier, I said Joel Osteen. It's talking about, you know, the um, the nation of Israel, false pastor, Slokia. Yeah. But um, I got a precept for you. Then we're going to go back to Jeremiah. This is um St. Matthews 20, 12 and 30. He that is not... This is Lord Yahweh I speaking. It's written in red. It says, He that is not with me is against me. Mm -hmm. And he that gathereth not with me scattereth abroad. Con. And that's what you um, pastors in churches are doing. You're not gathering with the with Yahweh by Shema Hashai. Because if, if you were scattering... If you were gathering with the Lord... You be with um you be under our apostles and elder of great millstone learning the true doctrine and you wouldn't be in the building teaching, you'd be out there on the highways and byways with a twelve chart sign wearing your garment with the fringes and border of blue. You know, you wouldn't be wearing a three piece um turtle suit, turtle neck suit, or anything like that. You'd be under the true men, you by Shemel Shai, and you'll be speaking out of the Bible and not being motivational speakers. So you know, and you're against Yahweh by Shema Shai, and he that is not against Yahweh, and he that you know, you your hands too short, box with God, you know, okay. you're over here you're fighting against your your Maker, you know, when you're against Yahweh, when you're against Yahweh Shai, and you're against the men that he set up a great millstone, mm -hmm. and you're scattering the sheep and death and destruction on you. Mm -hmm. But it's back in the book of Jeremiah, chapter twenty-three, verse one. Mm -hmm. Woe be unto the pastors. That destroy and shat, shat and scatter the sheep of my pastor, saith Yahweh by Shemel Shai. Mm -hmm. Therefore, thus saith the Lord, power of Israel mm -hmm. against the pastors that feed my people, mm -hmm. ye that scatter my flock and driven them away. Kind of, the brother said, wait, let me read it, I keep going, and have not visited them. Con. Uh, like the brother mentioned earlier, you know, all these fast, all these um false pastors, whenever um a shooting goes down, you know, Jake gets shot in the street. They're like, all right, guys, come down. We're going to um make a peace, right? We're going to make a peace thing. Mm -hmm. Hell no, you know. Well, ultimately, you know, it's judgment of the Lord. But these pastors are supposed to be telling you that the reason why, the, reason, the true reason why this happens is because we're under the curses. Right. And, you know, and we're here in America, and this isn't our rest, and we're here to serve punishment. Mm -hmm. And now we're supposed to come back to the law, statute, and commandments of the Bible. And that's another thing these pastors don't tell our people. They tell our people that the laws are done away with, you know. Mm -hmm. But if you came on the true men, you know, the men that Yahweh by Shema Shai set up according to his mind, then you'll know that we're supposed to follow the law, statute, and commandments right now to the best of our abilities. This is um, Jeremiah back in 23 and verse 2. And have not visited them, behold, I will visit upon you the evil of your doing, saith the Lord Yahweh by Shema Shai. I start up and read it one more time. Okay, come on. Jeremiah 23 and 2. Thus, therefore, thus saith the Lord Yahweh by Shema Shai, power of Israel, against the pastors that feed my people, ye have scattered my flock and driven them away. Mm -hmm. And have not visited them. All right, y'all, y'all, y'all scattered the sheep. You know, you fed the um, you fed the Most High's people, the nation of Israel, lies. You know, and, and it says scattered and driven them away. And you haven't after you scattered them and, and driven them away from the Most High, you haven't visited them. And it's not talking about like, it's not talking about going up to like their houses. You know, knocking on their doors. It's talking about you haven't came and gave them the truth. Period of the Bible. You haven't came to the nation of Israel and told them that you are the chosen people of the Most High. You haven't came and told them that. You know, um, um, you are the special people of the Bible that the Bible is talking about. You mm -hmm. haven't gave the nation of Israel the truth according to the Bible. Yep. And um, we're gonna. I got a priest up prove that it's talking about the nation of Israel. Okay. It's the same Matthew chapter fifteen verse twenty four, and this is written in red against. This is um who the world ignorantly calls Jesus Christ, Lord Yahweh, is speaking. So 
fucking. And it reads, But he answered and said, I, but he answered and said, I am not sent, but unto the lost sheep of the house of Israel. So when Lord Yahushai came on the scene, he came to gather his sheep, you know? And ultimately, he came to gather the, the elect of the nation of Israel, the remnant, because it, it's going to get into that in Jeremiah 23. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, like I said, you know, Yahweh Shema Shai is only sent to the house of Israel. You want any more in that second verse, or you want me to jump down to verse 3? Oh, keep going. All right, Jeremiah 23 and 3. And I will gather the remnant of my flock. And that's talking about the elect. And I will gather the remnant of my flock out of all countries whether I have driven them and bring them again to their folds and they shall be fruitful and increase kind of and that's talking about in um in the kingdom you know after America is destroyed and Yahweh by Shema Shai goes and gathers the elect from the four corners of the earth you know which I can get a priest up on that real quick this is um Jeremiah chapter 14 uh, it's like it's Jeremiah 16 verse 14 therefore thus saith the therefore behold this is Jeremiah 16 14 so like, yeah. therefore behold the days come saith the Lord Yahweh by Shema Shai that it should no more be said the Lord liveth that brought up the children of Israel out of the land of Egypt but the Lord liveth that brought up the children of Israel from the land of the north talking about America and from all the lands whither he have driven them, and I will bring them again into their land that I gave unto their fathers. Kind of it's talking about in the kingdom. That's proof that we're talking about in the kingdom of heaven, you know, when Lord Yahweh is reigning and we're joint heirs unto him. And um, you know, and we fell these nations are and under our feet and we became back to our back to the state where we were in the beginning as gods, you know. According to Psalms, the 82nd chapter, verse 6. You lay more in that Jeremiah 23? Real quick, did we get the part when it said, oh, and I will visit you upon your evil doings? That part? Oh, yeah, that was verse 2 again. You want that part again? Yeah. So, like, brothers, we can go back to Jeremiah 23, verse 2 again. So, like, yeah, I should have read good, verse good. 3. Um, and have not visited them. Yes, yeah, like, I forgot to read the end of so, like, yeah. Behold. I will visit, this is Jeremiah 23, verse 2 at the bottom. I will visit upon you the evil of your doings, saith the Lord. Right, so because you lying pastors, you know, you didn't come to the Most High people and give them the truth according to the Bible. Now he's going to come and visit you, you own, you false, and you know, you lying pastors. And he's going to visit you for your evil doings. You know, and when he visits you, it's not going to be a good thing. He's going to put you out of death. Mm -hmm. Ultimately by, I mean... Ultimately, by the ICBM missiles and those chariots. Going kind of in the famine. Mm hmm. In martial law, FEMA camp. Yep. Um. This is. All because you didn't speak according to this word. Yeah, Colin, the Lord says, shall he not visit you? And uh, I believe that's Jeremiah, the fifth chapter. We're not going to have to, we don't have to get it, but, you know, basically, you know, Yahweh Shema Shai is going to, um, you know, is going to repay the nation of Israel for, and repay, repay the pastors for all the wickedness they have done, you know? Okay. They sold out to the white man, you know? Mm -hmm. And it's talking about IUIC, GOCC, ISUBK, ISUBK, Sabak. Um, you know, and all these alphabetical camps, man. I don't know what's up with that, you know. Anyway, you got any more saying, any more scriptures? That's it. All right, Con. Hope your brother's been edified. Mm -hmm. You close this up, bro. Con. All right, it's been another GMS on the go. Once again, this is the Raleigh, North Carolina camp. Before we go any further, we want to give all honor, glory, and praises to the Heavenly Father, and His only begotten Son. Y'all by Shimmy, I was shy. Next up, double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone. We're teaching us this 100% truth of the Bible. And a double shalom to all the sincere outcomes throughout the four corners of the earth. Pushing this truth and righteousness and sincerity to the best of your abilities. Shalom. Shalom.